This is the last video I'm gonna make like this. <clears throat> Cause black folks just don't get it. Listen. You can hoop, you can holler, you can scream, you can march, you can ride. All that stuff makes white people money. Listen, when you burn down buildings, right? Who you think own the building? People got insurance, man. You burn down that building, it might be a half a million dollar bill. They gonna tell them people they had ten million dollars worth of uh, stuff on the inside. You, you lost, they ain't lose. They gonna rebuild the building and shit can be three times higher. When you march, right? Say like you got a million people go to D.C. and march. Who you think gonna be the security out there? The police. So white folk making money. Who you think you gonna pay the pot? White folk. So they making money. When you illegally pot, who you think gonna tow your car? White folk. When you stay in D.C., who you think own the hotels? White folk. Alright? Listen. There's but one way. You know, you got everybody sharing these videos. Oh, look at them. Look at them. There's but one way to stop this shit. For all, get it. You want respect from white people. It's one way to get it. <clears throat> and that's with the almighty dollar. The only time, the only time that any kind of black movement ever had an effect um, on what white people was doing was the boycott in Montgomery, Alabama. Or with the Birmingham. Wherever that bitch was at. That was boycott in Birmingham, I think it was. Might have been Montgomery. One of the motherfuckers. Well, anyway. <clears throat> no, it was in Montgomery. Well, anyway. Uh, you know, you see all these dudes, and they out there protesting, they got all them signs and all that shit, but here, here's the thing, all them dudes fuck the police and all that, police are paid by merchants, okay, people like Ralph Lauren, you know, all these people are behind the police, man. these people fund that shit, so you can go out here and say fuck them white people, but you got on polo. You marketing for them people while you saying fuck them people. Bro, all that shit is together. You know, as long as y'all keep rapping about these brands and supporting these brands, bro, them police gonna get bigger guns. They gonna get more bullets. Because the people that make money, the people like Ralph Lauren and them, they fund the police. They get them people money. Keep these niggas the fuck out of my neighborhood, man. I'm telling you, in order to do anything, anything, in a capitalist society, it has to start with the almighty dollar. And see, niggas think they're going to, you know, you got these black preachers that's going to preach their way out of this shit. And, and, and then you got these activists that's going to, you know, get you in the uproar. Man, listen, I'm going to tell you the truth. Until black people start supporting black people, ain't nothing going to happen. And guess what? This shit ain't going to happen because black people don't support black people. Black people don't even like your status. They don't share your status. They don't even give you no positive encouragement. So you know they ain't going to stand side by side with you. It's sad this shit happening, and that's about it. You know what I'm saying? I don't get involved in that bullshit because I already know black folk going to leave your ass hanging for real. And tomorrow, after all this shit over, they still going to go out here and spend all their money on the same brands that keep them enslaved. Timberland, Polo. You know, none of them people fucking love you, man. Every damn you get them people, man, them people is funding the police, man. They getting the police more guns, more uniforms, better Kevlar. And they pay, man, when the police smoke niggas, who you think they giving them people them same eight, nine million dollars to defend themselves? Them people, bro. But if they didn't have the money to... Uh, get the police out on bond. Or if they ain't had the money to pay for their cases, police will stop doing that shit. Why don't people buy juries, man? Who you think the judge is? You think the judge is on your side? Bro, this country was founded by slave owners. Them judges, them CEOs, they all tied together, bro. Nobody is fucking with no nigga, man. For real. At the end of the day, man, if, if, if we don't come together... Bro, ain't shit gonna happen. You, and people are like, well, the police killing it. Bro, Google, Google, uh, 
uh, pictures of a black man being hung. I mean, it's, a lot of them pictures are new. Black people have never stopped being killed by the police, man. Black people have never stopped killing each other, and the police will never stop killing black people. Bro, they got pictures on the internet. People are like, well, well, it's just that they got cameras. Man, they been had cameras. If you Google uh, a black man being lynched, bro, you'll see it's thousands of white people watching black people get lynched, clapping and smiling at the camera. Ain't shit new out here, man. Nothing is new. It's just that black people have so been been so indoctrinated where they think it actually stopped. It never stopped. Never. And it ain't going to stop. It's going to get worse now because for several reasons. One, because we have more immigrants coming here, and these immigrants are more are, are more positive. They're moving in a positive light. They, they're working together. You have the Asians. You have the Indians. Um, you have the uh, Spanish. They all moving together. And you know what they're going to do? They're going to eradicate niggas, man, because niggas, they like, y'all don't even work together. No, we damn, y'all can't even help each other. You, y'all damn sure ain't going to do nothing but take from us. Y'all take from each other. So you know what the best thing to do? Let's get rid of them niggas. Let's lock them up. Let's give them AIDS. And the ones that's out here that don't, that, that's in the way, we're going to kill their ass. Straight up. And if you can't see that, you blind. All that posting on Facebook is horse shit. Do something about it. You want to do something? Start supporting your people, man. You know, all that crying and... Bro, that shit ain't going to change nothing. It's just a bunch of niggas doing the same shit. And tomorrow morning, you know what's going to happen? They're going to go to sleep, wake up. And spend all their money on white folks shit.